I am one challenge away from unlocking the expert mastery calling card in zombies. And that challenge is to kill a warlord within the first seven minutes of a match. I will also be trying to unlock the exorcist mastery calling card. And to do that, I need to get 30 legendary or wonder weapons from the mystery box. And currently I only have eight. So let's see if we can get these done. There's probably no better time to try to unlock this calling card than right now. Because currently you can get into the warlord's fortress without the key card. And I got this strategy from a clip on reddit from doomsday crypto his strategy was coming here with the xrx stalker and bring in the scorcher and hopefully we should be able to take it out I'll, I'll show you guys my build for the the xrk stalker in case you want to try this for yourselves and here's everything that i brought in with me as well but we need to get all the way over to here and take out the warlord in less than seven minutes now and the one thing i'm missing from my setup here is deadshot i think deadshot would definitely help out a lot but uh i put everything into my backpack and then I closed my game to go ahead and open up my recording software. And when I reopened it back up, Deadshot was gone from my backpack. It just deleted itself. Because I may or may not still have a few things in my item stash over the limit. But I'm hoping we can still get this done. All right, here's the Warlord's Fortress. It's uh, pretty important we don't aggro these guys. Let's see if we can get on top of this building here. There we go. Caught the rope. Let's see if we can assassinate her. Where is she? All right, we can't see her from right here, but plan B. This is why we have the Scorcher. We can get set up right over here, right behind the sentry turrets. Now, where is she? I take both those sentries out. Let's start doing some damage to her. Oh, she's already dead. That was like a two shot kill. Let's go. That was way easier than I thought. Honestly, I thought it was going to be way more shots to kill her. But that was easy. Let's get out of here before they kill me. I don't even care about that reward. That was so simple. And what makes it even more convenient to get that done now is that with the last update, every player was given uh, every wonder weapon case. So everybody should have access to the Scorcher. All you got to do is play one game and all the stuff should appear in your inventory. And you also get a flawless crystal or three flawless crystals and three legendary aether tools. So you can even do more damage than I did there. But now I want to see if we can actually get this other calling card done. We need to somehow get, what was it, 22 weapons out of the mystery box? Legendary or wonder weapon? So that's going to cost us basically 22000 if we get it on every single pull out of the box. So we need to make some money now. And I think the best way to do it with how much damage the sniper is doing is to try to do as many bounties as we can. So let's break the mask on him. This disciple's got more health than the warlord. Not for long, though. Just need one more shot. Stay still. There we go. Maybe we can get some good loot to bring out of this too. Oh, this is so unfortunate. There is no bounties here in tier two. I don't know how well this would do in tier three. So I built this basically all for damage and like aim stability. We can do a quick little Uber delivery. Maybe it'll free up space for a bounty to spawn. Just another honest day's work. What do we got from that? Basically nothing. And just because we were in the area, I picked up a tier one bounty. I want to see how fast this kills them. Oh that fast apparently he saw what we did to the warlord and didn't want none of it but the money we get from tier ones isn't gonna cut it that's only two thousand which is two box spins but we could have three or even five so i think i might risk it and go try to do some tier threes especially since there's nobody over there right now let's do a quick cargo the freest money you can ever get let's get it delivered there we go got nothing from it though i mean besides the cash maybe we should go ahead and challenge ourselves let's see if we can take down a tier three bounty I think this thing can do enough damage to fight him. Oh, and it's a mega abomination. Maybe I shouldn't have said anything. All right, well, if there was ever a time to do crazy damage, it's now. I don't think we're doing a whole lot. Maybe this was a mistake. There we go. We blew up one of his faces. We got something. We just need him to shoot a few more lasers. There we go. Come on, just gonna tank through it. Oh, there's way too many zombies here. Oh, another laser. Come on. There we go, blew up his face. It was a clutch shot. What health is he at? About half. There's no way. We need to do so much more. Oh, here we go, another laser. Now's our time. We stopped the laser, but it didn't kill him. 
Come on. This is taking way too long for what we need to be doing. Oh, and the final laser, hopefully. Almost got him. There we go. Woo. Barely survived that, too. Well, that's a good chunk of change. Oh, and a tombstone. What else did we get? Uh, nothing special. I'm gonna try another, but if it's another mega abomination, I'm canceling it. We can take out any other elite. There's actually a whole building here to loot. I'm getting distracted and lost. How do I get out of here? There we go. Oh, and there's another mega abomination. Damn it. Cancel. Any tier two bounty spawn? They did. All right, we're going over there. Come on, give me something easy. Actually, they're all gonna be pretty easy. Disciple probably the hardest out of those, though. Where are you at? There it is. gone we gotta non-stop make money i'm doing whatever the closest contract to me is whether it's a bounty or a cargo and i'm robbing every gas station i see no cash register is safe there we go damn these rewards suck i think we get better loot doing all these contracts i used up all my loot luck last time i played oh we got two bounties let's go Damn, we are just out here head hunting. Nothing is safe from us. Okay, let's do one more bounty and then we need to start hitting the box. We're almost at 40k. Who's the lucky bastard? A mimic. I don't even think he sees us. Idiot. See you later. It actually takes way more shots to kill him when you're not hitting him in the crit. There we go. All right, now where is a mystery box? Right over here. I wonder if the mystery boxes in different tiered zones have better luck. Like if I were to use the mystery box in tier three, do I have a better chance of getting legendaries or is it all the same rarity or like randomness? I guess we'll find out. Oh, first legendary right away. Let's go. Keep them coming. Oh, epic. Or maybe it has something to do with how late into the game you are. Because we're coming down here on the last few minutes. So maybe our luck is a bit higher. Come on. Damn. They wanted to give us a legendary weapon right off the bat and then nothing after. I'm being trolled. What is it like beginner's luck? Only one spin per game legendary? Nope. There we go. We just got to talk shit to it. Give us another one. Actually, you know what? I don't even want one. Hmm. Gonna look away. Chin up. Don't care. Damn it. Okay. Now I actually, I do want one. Let's shoot the corners. Oh, damn it. We gotta find a new spot. Where are you heading to, mystery box? There's another one right over here. So I think now we're at a total of 10 out of 30. We just need a good 20 spins of legendaries and we'll be all right. I think we'll at least get two on this one. If our last few spins are anything to go off of. Oh, let's go. Oh, and a wonder weapon, the VR-11. Perfect. Let's hope we didn't get all of our luck right out of the way. The VR-11 is actually perfect. We can just turn all these zombies into mercenaries and have them leave me the hell alone. Oh, and the Wonder Wolf. Let's go. Give me the ray gun too. You know what? Give me every single wonder weapon in this one game. Oh, or more legendaries. I'll take those. Oh, we got 15. So we're halfway there. And it's moving again. That's fine. We had really good luck on that one. Where's the next mystery box? Right over here, right down the road. Back to business. Let's keep the luck going. Nope. Ooh, the pull rates on the box has actually been really good today. I wonder if it's always like this. I hardly ever use the mystery box. And it's treating me. Oh, and the bunny again. We got 15,000 left. And I think we need 14 or 13 more legendary weapons. We can do it. Off to the next mystery box. And I think it respawned back at the old location. Our good luck mystery box is back. And it still loves us. Oh, this is the easiest challenge of my life. Oh, I'm the best gambler in the history of gambling. No one gambles better than me. Oh, the bunny heard me say it. We actually got the strat down. The box just keeps switching between these two spots. This is super easy. All right, we got six spins left. And I think maybe six legendary weapons left that we need. Ooh, one for one right now. Two for two. Three for three. I'm batting a hundred. Oh, the bunny stopped it. Four for four, no fucking Wendy's. Go to the fucking Wendy's, dude. Oh, we got it. Just in time. We got a thousand left and another legendary after that. You know what? We got, we got enough for two more spins. What are we getting on these last two? Oh, an epic. Last one for all the marbles. It's the bunny. That's very fitting. Got it done right at the buzzer for the Aether Storm too. That's crazy. What's going on, Bussy Dookie Neck? Crazy ass name, dude. 
I fuck with it though. Honestly, a name like Dookie Neck makes me kind of regret naming myself J Money. There's so many better names out there. But now we're stuck. Damn, what an efficient game. No way, did we freeze coming out of the game? Uh-uh, I better still have my calling card. There we go. Complete all the expert challenges. Now, if we go to our zombies calling cards, let's go. Expert mastery, done. Exorcist mastery, done. Honestly, I think they probably should have switched the calling cards because this one looks way cooler and I'm definitely using this one. But I'll toss this bad boy into my showcase. But that's all I got for you guys today. Thank you for watching. I truly appreciate all your love and support and I will see you in the next one. Later.